Olivia Wilde is an American actress and filmmaker, born, March 10, 1984, New York, United States. I was a tomboy and I didn't have a bunch of brothers but I always wanted them and so I sort of adopted a few of my great friends to be my brother. Oh God, to think that you only fall in love once in your entire life is such a depressing thought. A lot of people assume that women of a certain age who are not unattractive have no excuse for not having a perfect life. But you can have emotional baggage that is dragging you down like cement blocks tied to your feet. The thing that's wonderful about social media is that we are able to give a voice to the voiceless and to help educate each other. I benefit from it as much as I provide those lessons. Mick Jagger has produced some great films and brought us stories about the music industry that have changed the way we think about how music is made. I never thought I would actually call him my boss, let alone meet Mick Jagger or have any reason to say my name in the same sentence as his. When you a darker brunette and have pale skin like I do, it can wash you out a bit, so learning to contour is really helpful. I think you can be a bit more bold with eye makeup to define your eyes, and the same with lip colors, you can go for dark wine colors, which I love. A good litmus test is that you should be comfortable with your significant other being present when you hang out with your friend. You're going to change as you grow older, and that messes up a lot of relationships. It's not actually okay to just be apathetic about anything. I guess for my skin, I clean it and moisturize and try to drink water. How boring is this though? I'm convinced that it comes from within. If you're happy and healthy, it shows. All actors should experience public failure. Many casting directors won't hire aspiring actors because you might be burning some chick's headshot under the table so she doesn't get the part. Early on, I knew I had ideas, but I wasn't sure when it was appropriate to bring them to the table, and I was so intimidated by these titans that I was working for. But it started around the time of Tron, when I was really excited by the creative process and the prep that went into that. I spoke up often at those writing sessions. I have very high standards for every part of life, my work, my relationships, food, love. I can't just pretend. Documentaries are a powerful and effective way of bridging the gap between worlds, breaking through to new audiences that wouldn't otherwise be engaged, in essence, not preaching to the choir, 